Hey guys, today I'm gonna to be doing an unboxing and an installation of the Runcam Thumb Pro Wide Edition. I'm gonna go ahead and open this box up and solder it onto a Beta FPV Cetus X. And I'll show you guys how to do that in this video. And then hopefully get some quick flight test in. It's awfully windy outside. But if we finish the the soldering job here and don't have any issues, we'll go fly it. All right, once this focuses in, I'm gonna pause it and kind of explain what's going on back here. The Run Cam Pro Edition has the normal five volt and ground, as you can see on the bottom, but it actually added in a receive and transmit port on the top, the RX and TX. And what that does is you can solder those to your flight controller and you can control the run cam from your radio either with a switch or a button so you can actually stop and start the recording using your radio so it's a pretty cool feature they added I didn't end up using it just because I already have my radio kind of set up how I want it and I don't mind just clicking the button on the run cam once I start flying so just wanted to explain that and pretty cool feature if you want to use that Alright, as the drone flies in here and we get ready to start taking it apart to install the run cam, I just wanted to make a quick announcement. We are getting awfully close to hitting the 100 subscriber goal and once we hit 100, I'm going to be buying a new 5 inch drone that you guys pick out. So if you have any recommendations or any drones you guys want to see unboxed and flown, Please post those in the comments below. I'll be looking. And as soon as we hit 100, I'm going to buy one. So let me know which one you guys think I should buy. All right guys, got out the flight controller and what we're gonna be looking for is a five volt and a ground to use. And it looks like on this one, there is one right here. Five volt and a ground. It's gonna be hard to see on the camera. You probably won't be able to see it.
Here we go. First turn on after putting it all together. Let's see if it's gonna work. What's up guys this is me from the future now I went out and flew after soldering on the run cam to the flight controller but for some reason the memory chip got corrupt or it just didn't function right so I lost those recordings but I still want to get some new footage for you guys to uh, make this video and it's dark out now, I just got off work, but I think I'm going to go down to the main street of the town I'm working in and see if I can fly uh, the main street at night. What's up guys, we just got down here. I've never flew out of my car before and it's dark outside. We're on the main street of town, so it's going to be pretty fun. <laughs> See how this goes. I just got back to the camper we ended up fucking crashing pretty hard right into the pavement and breaking the little mount for this run cam snapped it right off run cam is fine and it actually recorded the video up until about 15 seconds before the crash so it sucks it didn't get the crash on film but if you like this video please consider subscribing at 100 subscribers i'm gonna be buying a five inch drone that you guys pick out so please leave a comment down below on which five inch drone you guys want to see me buy and i'll be buying that right away thank you